Good evening, good evening, good evening. If we can get started for the November, uh, Delta Amateur Radio Club membership meeting, I would love to uh, say hello to everyone and welcome y'all all to the November meeting. Uh, with that, thank you all for being here. This is the, the fun season that we have as the club activities. November is a fun month. We get to have elections and we have a big prize drawing that we have for the tickets that we've collected over the year. And I've got an opportunity, I think, during the welcome activity where a person or two might actually win an extra ticket or two. Um, so, love seeing everybody. Let's uh, take a quick moment and let's do a quick welcome for everybody. What I'd like to do is I'd like for every table to talk amongst yourself real quick and come up with the one thing as a table that you would tell a new amateur radio licensee, a new hand. What would you tell them? The one thing that you would tell them. Okay, so each table come up with that amongst yourselves. Uh, let's see if we can come up with a, a real quick introduction after you have a minute or two to discuss amongst yourselves. Thank you. Buy lottery tickets. Study hard and be protective. Get one. The HFB. All right, all right. Norm Rodriguez. So now that we've got everybody talking amongst themselves at the tables, and everybody's figured out what they would tell a new hand. Um, let's start over here at this table. Introduce yourselves and as a collective at the table. Let me know what you would tell a new hand. So we'll start right here at this table. Introduce yourselves and tell us what you would tell a new hand. Hi, I'm Mark, KO4KQA. Now, we'll, after you can introduce at the table, then you'll tell us what you'll tell a new hand. I'm Tim. Yep. I'm John, KK4LST. Doug. I'm Will, KQ4FUM. All right. What would you tell a new hand? There's something for everybody. Yeah, there's something for everybody. Excellent. Fantastic. All right, we'll move to the next table in the back corner. I'm Jeff, KX4LO. I'm uh, John, KJ4NWU. Steve. Ron. Vernon. Uh, get a good antenna. Alright, so the table in the back. What did you come up with that you could tell the new name? Get a good antenna. Get a good antenna. Fantastic. Alright, we'll move to the table there in the back. Billy, WL4B. Rick, N0KYN. Richard, K4DXF. Rick, WA4NDN. Barry, W5CJ. And our answer is? So we got to actually have two for one for young ones. The younger, the younger crowd, the new ones, swipe oh. left. <laughs> if you don't understand what that means, ask them. The, for the older people to be, that's okay, but honey, I got one for you too. <laughs> okay, I think that one wins, but we'll see. All right, next table right up here in the front. Norm, KO4QLD. Jonathan, KO4WAQ. And Steve, KK4BPT. And what would y'all tell the new hand? Go ahead, yours was. Go ahead. Uh, you, you, you'll, you'll, you'll never finish learning, but you'll also never finish having fun. There you go. That's a very good one as well. Never finish learning, never finish having fun. Fun. Fantastic. All right. Table in the back. Come in for LIA. Ed, KA4BLL. Ron, K4MAX. Dan, KN4FBJ. Janet, KN4FBI. 
Barry one, WB four, SWP. And your sage advice to a new ham? Go ahead. Read it and ask questions before making a stupid mistake. <laughs> That is a very that's that's good advice in a lot of things just besides the amateur radio. Um, read and ask questions before you make a silly mistake. Fantastic. All right, we'll move next door in the back. Randy, KQ four J H. Perry, November four, Golf Juliet. Scott, KM four, B and U. Laura, no call. Jim, KD four, F U U. Treasure. And your sage advice to a new ham? We were going to tell them if they if they start off with the HT for their first radio that they've got to upgrade their antenna. If you start with an HT, you need a, a better antenna. That is excellent advice. All right, we'll come forward to this table here. Dave, AD4Q. Dana, WI3B. Bob, KM4SEB. Tom, AC5, MR. And your sage advice for a new ham? Get a receiver and listen a lot before you try to start talking. Get a receiver and listen before you start transmitting. Excellent, excellent advice as well. All right, we'll move to the back table there in the middle. Randall's KY4, KY. Jim, B, JJ4 GCE. Bill, KJ4 BPS. Carmen, KQ4 TQV. M, W4 GMM. All right, and y'all have got a wise group there on that table. Ham's at your table. What's your sage advice for new hands? Find yourself a good Elmer. Find a good Elmer. Excellent, excellent advice. All right, we'll move up to the next table. Don, KZ4 GJ. Paul, KY4MX. Scott, KQ4TGW. Uh, Caleb, KQ4KLJ. Uh, and your table say advice to a new ham? We're going to steal it from Joe Lowenthal. <laughs> 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 here's what it is your license to your learner permit. Working it is what you do. Good advice. Your license is your learner's permit. Working it is how you do it. Good advice. Thank you for sharing. That was straight from our director of training, Joe Loventhal. All right, we'll do the front table right up here. Uh, Josh, take you for ILS. Tyler, take you for QEV. Dan, AA4DF. Adam, k 4 SPB. Not Matt. No call sign yet. I heard yet. Yeah. And what was the new sage advice that y'all would give a new ham? Because y'all actually have a new ham at your table. It's expensive. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you, can, you can do as little or as much as you want to make of it. So the advice was it's expensive. You can do as little or as much as you make of it. So that was fun. All right, so let's do it real quick. Who should we give an extra couple of tickets to? Which table had the best advice? One over here in the front, one in the back. All right, unanimous, the one in the front? Yes. All right, it's expensive win. I'll bring you a couple of extra raffle tickets. <laughs> just a second. All right, with that, I am going to uh, welcome everybody and say thank you. Perry, I'm going to ask you if you would call us to order real quick by calling the roll. President Joe Plunk. Present. Vice President Tyler Henley. Present. Treasurer Jim Martin. Here. Secretary Perry Hayes. Present, Director of Training Joe Lowenthal here. Director of Programs John Reiners. Director of Publications Mike Harrison. Repeater Trustee Dan Fleet here. Director of Meetings and Special Events Scott Adams here. Public Information Officer Adam White here. We do have a quorum, Mr. President. Thank you, Perry. I appreciate that greatly. All right, let's move to uh, real quick, and uh, we've got a couple of new business items that we'll knock out of the way because I know everybody is really super anxious to get to the drawings. So that's what we're here for, right? That's right. Yeah. That's right. All right. Uh, we need to read and approve the minutes. I make a motion. 
The fruit of men and the treasurer's report is published in Sparta. We've got that one down pat. A uh, handmade motion to uh, approve the minutes as published in Sparks and was seconded by many people. Pick one. All in favor, please say aye. 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 Any opposed? Fantastic. All right, we're going to do a quick round of board member reports and we'll start off. Um, I'll start with myself, just to lead off and say I just want to thank all the membership that's here tonight. Appreciate everyone that's here. I look forward to the next year that's coming up, both uh, December and wrapping up this year, and uh, the next year going forward. Um, I would ask really strongly, and there's a signal report survey on your table. Um, one of the things that I would ask you to do is fill that out tonight. If you haven't filled it out any other night, fill it out tonight, because there's one question on there about what was one thing that you would like to see the club do next year. I'd love to hear that answer from every member that's here tonight. I sure would love it. All right, with that, I'm going to move over to Tyler. Uh, uh, any report? No. Thanks for being here. Awesome. Perry? Uh, no additional report. Uh, Mr. Treasurer Jim? Uh, Jim, waiting for it for you. Um, just a reminder that uh, it's that time of year to renew your membership. So I'll be happy to take your move on. $20 for another year. There are plenty of forms up here to fill out, and I assure you all have a twenty dollar bill that you can hand Jim and just get your renewal done tonight out of the way. Thanks for reminding us. Jim. I have forms back here as well. Fantastic. <laughs> all right, John Riders is not here. That's me and <coughs> Scott. You got any report, Scott? No. Excellent. Scott does a fantastic job providing for us. Uh, Mike is absent. He had uh, some issues pop up. The director of training, Joe. Uh We have a uh, general class uh, that started last week. Uh, we have seven in the in the class. Uh, we will go for three Thursday nights in November and then two in December. Uh, we will have a test session on December the 12th if someone is wanting to upgrade uh, their license or, or get a license uh, if they pre-register, let me know ahead of time so we can get it on the roster. It's at the Memphis Police Department, uh, Appling Farm Station uh, training room. More than happy to test uh, that night. Uh, then uh, <clears throat> I'm not sure uh, about an extra class. Uh, it looks like I'm gonna have some surgery and I'm not sure how long I'll shouldn't be out uh, but uh, three or four days of commission uh it'll probably if with the surgery i probably are going to do it on zoom and not try to have it in person uh, and we've done that zoom class uh several times dave you gonna teach uh, come I'm on available, I think. <laughs> uh, and also we, we had uh Testing tonight, we had three technicians and one general. Matt is one of the technicians. And he helped us out at Bluff City Blues bike ride uh, with, his, with Josh, his brother. Um, and uh, I'm trying to think, is anybody else here that tested tonight? Back up, back up. Oh, okay. Uh, Vernon uh, got general. So, uh, yes. When's that extra class going to be? It'll be on Saturdays uh, from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Uh, most likely via Zoom. When you start? Uh, six or seven weeks. I'm going to have to look at the schedule. It'll be six Saturday nights. We normally take a break on the last weekend of January okay. because that's the Jackson, Mississippi Ham Fest and it's also uh, winter field day so we take a break uh, from Sometime that. in January then. What is that? Sometime in January? The end of January? Start. We start in Jan uh, the first week Saturday in January okay. and then the last Saturday in January we'll not meet and then go into February. 
Okay. Uh, for three Saturday. Okay. Three or four, I've got to check. Uh, Dave, do you remember how many? I didn't. When you call me, the classes run together for me, so okay. most of them are six classes long. Uh, I do know where the, you can find the next set of information for that. Check your next issue of Sparks. Okay. It, it'll be there. Yep. Mm -hmm. But uh, all right. Any other questions on training? All right. Thank you. Thank you, Joe. All right, Matt. You get a bonus ticket. Oh, thank you. Because you passed your license. Oh, thanks for your sage advice. I'll get a bonus. All right, and you got anything you'd like to report? As a trustee? Um, okay, the uh, go ahead to order the DMR here. So, pieces of parts are be coming in there over the next month or so. So, I'm, I'm hoping in the year we'll be transmitting. And, uh, so stay tuned. Wait, got that. I thought that was funny. Uh, <laughs> and uh, got the got the APRS note going back up at Methodist North. And I think two twenties next. I had an hour talking about what to do to attack that problem. And that's it. Right. Might ask for any money today. <laughs> Fantastic. Although I will uh, put a shameless plug in for Dan, he still needs uh, members to help him adopt repeater sites. So if you're willing to adopt a repeater site, just keep an eyeball on it. Make sure it's uh, if you're in the neighborhood of it to do that. Let Dan or any of the other board members know. That would be a huge help. Um, not to forget Adam here, our PIO. You got anything you'd like to add? Uh, nothing as the PIO, we can be a single slide. I got a wind link station up and running last week. Uh, it's on 144.99. It's got packet and VARA. Uh, so you can use a sound card or a TNC if you have any questions, let me know. Thank you much. Appreciate that. Good to have a new packet repeater in play. All right. Uh, with that, I'm going to move right into uh, uh, and ask our nomination uh, committee uh, chairperson to come up and present the election real quick and then we'll get to what everybody's waiting on the drawings. About the elections what everybody Of course. With bated breath. <laughs> By the way, thank you Perry for serving as the nomination committee chair. Thank you Joe and thank you again to uh, Josh and Don, who also did a lot of work to help me out on that. Uh, last month at the October meeting, the nominations committee put a slate of candidates in nomination for tonight's election. Are there any, is there anyone here that would like to put anyone in nomination for one of our offices? All right. The slate was, I'll just run back through that again, for president, uh, Joe Plunk was nominated for vice president, Tyler Henley, for treasurer, Jim Martin, for director of training, Joe Lowenthal, for director of meetings and special events, Scott Adams, for director of programs, Adam White, for secretary, Perry Hayes, and for director of publications, Mike Harrison. That is the slate. Since we have no other nominations, we will vote for the entire slate by acclamation. So if I could please ask everyone uh, that would support the election of this slate, please signify that by saying aye. Aye. Do we have any opposed? All right, the motion passes unanimously. Thank you all very much. All right, it's that time. All right, a big bucket. Does anybody, has anybody not put their ticket in for tonight? When you came in, did you put your tickets in? They're extras. Ah, oh, yeah, the, 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 the best advice, ham radio is expensive. All right, is there anybody else holding a ticket that needs to drop it into the bucket? All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. 
All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to draw the, anybody else got a ticket? All right, we're going to draw for the uh, a mystery box. And the mystery box, there's two of them, and the mystery box is the only prize that if you win it, you can still be eligible for another prize, okay, because the mystery box is a mystery box. All right, and I'm going to, I'm going to draw the first one. And then each successive winner will draw the next ticket. Does that sound like a good plan? All right, here we go. All right, what did I draw? R A T. All right, you get to come pick your mystery box. Saves on ink. You, if you get drawn again, you're still eligible for whichever prize. These are the two mystery boxes. All right. Very good. Before you leave, you pick the next winner. Next mystery box is K D four F U U. Jim, come pick your mystery box. <laughs> All right, Jim's going to draw another name and pay the mystery box forward. Let me tell you what the next prize is. Just one second. I'll tell you what the next one is that we're drawing for. We are drawing for a pair of Play-Doh side cutters. All right, so this is the prize. And in for the OK, Jim Barnes. There you go. Congratulations. All right, we'll draw the next ticket. Let's see while you're doing that. I'll tell you what you're drawing it for. I'm going to just take it this way. For, uh, the next prize on the list is a 446 piece heat shrink kit. All right. Uh, in for Golf Juliet, Perry wins the heat shrink kit. And the next prize we're drawing for is a Goya dual band HT antenna. <laughs> he drew his own name. We'll throw that, we'll throw that one back. It's, it's all above board, I promise. <laughs> Uh, Taylor KQ4 KLJ. Congratulations. All right, there's your HT. You draw a ticket. And we're doing another Nagoya ticket. Excuse me, another Nagoya tenant. To K4 KWR. Bob, no one. Please come grab your HT antenna. Are you here? Must be present to win. Oh, 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 that's a downer. That's a down. Sorry about that. All right, we're all in the place. We didn't realize we had a sign key there. WA4 OBO, Joe. An HT antenna. Unless you want to. All right. You want to draw the next ticket? We are drawing for the 
two 10 meter hand sticks. Going down deep. KT4KMR. Snodgrass. I don't believe he's here. At least he ain't dead. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Draw another one. Over. 30 years of fire. Actually, KA4BLL. KA4BLL. <laughs> Ned, uh, Joe is giving you the option. You can either pick the HT antenna or the 10 meter hand stick. All right. All right. So then N0 KYN. You can either pick the HT antenna or the next prize on the list, which was a, a, a TID radio HT. Rick is coming forward. Uh, a TID radio or an HT antenna. <laughs> TID radio wins. All right. We'll draw the next team. That'll be for a TID radio or an HT antenna. Uh, you had two, so I'm assuming it was the top one. Yeah. All right. KK4LST, John. You can pick between a radio and an HT antenna. Radio wins again. All right. The radio is right here. Go pick a ticket. You need one. Just right All right. KK4, Victor Papatango. Yeah. there. So your choices, um, you've got a 20 amp hour LiPo battery or an HT antenna. <laughs> Art decisions. Decisions, decisions, decisions. I think I'll go with the battery. Battery wins. That was an easy one. The next one is a, a 10 piece coax adapter kit from Chat Radio or an HT antenna. A four N V M. Going once, going twice, not here. Next ticket. Hey, is it WA4? NVM. NVM. He's sitting right here. Rick. Rick. But he's already won. No, oh, he had a bunch of junk. Oh, you're so <laughs> right. He got the box of junk. You got to speak up, Rick. <laughs> you can pick between an, H, an HT antenna or a, a coax adapter kit. Oh, exit after kit wins. Fantastic. So the next um, the next prize is a nano VNA or an HT antenna. Rick, you gotta pick the ticket though. Sorry I gotta make you walk back over here. <laughs> oh, well. hey, that's the third time charm. It's the third time. Alright. Alright, let's see. Jim, KD4, FUU. That's twice for him. That's twice for you. Yeah. All right. But well, you got to pick another one, though. <laughs> <laughs> Exercise. <laughs> All right, wait. You should wait. There's two. Pick which one you want. Fair enough. <laughs> KN4 FBJ. KN4 FBJ. Man. Nano VNA or an HP The next the next prize is a Baofeng 
H T E O R Radio. Friday, man. Got a boat ticket for us, please. I won't be here. Yeah, they may take a couple. All right, in for B O K. Jim Barnes. Oh, I've already won. I've already won. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> All right, Matt Cunningham. All right, look at that. He his ticket tonight and wins either a radio or an HT. There you go. Pick a radio. Wise choice. Good job, Matt. All right, pick a ticket for us. Not quite as expensive now. That's an excellent. That's excellent. All right, pull another one because WA4 OBO is already won. Give him, give him the antenna. <laughs> okay. He, he, he gave you his HC antenna. Oh, there you go. And it'll fit that. All right. So the next one, KQ4TGW. Scott. All right. Look at that. Because the next prize is um, the Tiny SA. Tiny SA is the next one on the list. All right, so the next one on the list is the Bow Fang. All right. In four, be okay, Jim. It was your night tonight. All right, one more. All right. KM4, SGB, Bob. Not done. One more. Third time's a charm. Going for the bow fan. All right, and Lynn W four M MKS. MKS. Thank you, Lynn. I don't see Lynn here either. All right, KK four BPT. I've already won. Yep, already won the white club. You could swap. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't have instant call sign re recognition yet. K4DXF. Richard. All right, you have an HT. And you get to pick the grand prize winner. I'll just swap. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that is yours. And the grand prize is a power pole kit. Oh, does that antenna go here? Um, this is a CB antenna. Yeah, I go with it. You would like for it to have a we make that happen. KY4MY. KY4MY. Present? Awesome. Woo! Congratulations. <laughs> Pull one more ticket for us for the consolation prize. There we go. Uh, K KJ4 NW. You, John. All right. Eleven meter in. Thank you very much. All right. That was a lot of fun. Thanks everyone for participating in that. Look forward to doing that next year. Um, we're going to take a quick break, socialize a little bit, say hello to everybody. Um, lots of snacks, coffee, drinks over on the tables. We'll get back together in, say, 10 minutes. And after that, uh, Dan is going to present an introduction uh, to Linux for us and how that can be uh, used in our uh, coffee. See everyone in 10 minutes. <laughs>